Hi, I'm Stephanie, and my FRP project is on developing an explainable AI model for ECG assessment. Electrocardiogram, in short, ECG, is one of the most significant sources of diagnostic information for cardiovascular diseases. In current clinical settings, ECG assessment are typically carried out using a cloth lead ECG system. It can be analyzed to detect diseases by searching for irregular waveform or rhythm. However, classification of ECG signal is a challenging problem as the signals exhibit significant variance in their morphological and temporal property across different patients under various physical conditions. With the advancement in processing large volume of raw data and signal processing technique, computer-aided interpretation of ECG signal is a massive relief for medical staff. However, there have been concerns over the possibility of bias in this AI model due to their black box nature. This can have far-reaching consequences, especially in healthcare applications where human life are directly involved. Therefore, the explainability and interpretability of this AI model are needed to enhance trust while using such systems. In this project, we aim to develop a robust AI model for assessing 12 lead ECG signals while providing interpretable explanation for its prediction using explainable AI technique. Generally, there are two different approaches for leveraging deep neural networks to handle such problems. First is the traditional feature-based approach, where features are first extracted using signal processing technique or by expert. Then these features are used to build classifiers. The second approach is to build an entire neural network-based classification pipeline that operates directly on raw ECG signals. In this project, we propose an innovative hybrid approach that aims to combine these two approaches. We leverage the combination of a ResNet model and discrete wavelet transformation, in short DWT, to achieve accurate prediction of cardiac diseases based on ECG signals. ResNet CNN is known for its ability to learn deep representation from raw data and has achieved state-of-the-art performance on many recognition parts. DWT is a popular signal processing technique used to analyze ECG signals as it is able to capture both the temporal and spectral characteristics. Our approach aims to build on the strength of these two techniques. The approach first begins by extracting feature map from the ResNet model and statistical feature using DWT. Then the, these two set of features are fed into a deep neural network to predict cardiac diseases. Finally, we employ shape to explain the model prediction. Our approach is evaluated on the PTP XL dataset, which is the largest to the publicly accessible dataset. Our result shows that the hybrid approach outperformed an end-to-end ResNet model in predicting the positive instances of patients with diseases. This is evident as it achieved higher recall for all four disease labels. As misidentifying a positive patient can have severe consequences such as delayed treatment, it is crucial to maximize recall for diseases. This can also have significant clinical implications in terms of early detection and treatment of this condition. As discussed earlier, we have utilized SHAP to get insight into the decision-making process behind the model prediction and understand how the ResNet and DWT feature work together to improve performance. The result has shown that the combined features are particularly effective in identifying the harder to detect cases. By combining these two set of features, we can potentially capture more complex patterns and characteristics in the data, enabling more accurate identification of cardiac diseases. The chart on the slide shows the top 20 features with the highest contribution towards the prediction across all the test samples. It demonstrates how the ResNet and DWT feature contribute to the hybrid model predictions. Another key interesting finding from our shape analysis is that DWT features are highly influential in identifying abnormal ECG signal. The chart on the slide shows the top 20 features with the highest contribution towards predicting normal ECG. Each point represents the share value for the corresponding feature and a particular instance. We observe that the share value of this DWT feature are mostly negative 
and large in absolute value. Indicating a strong signal from this feature is strongly associated with not predicting the normal class and may be indicative of diseases. This reinforces our understanding that the incorporation of DWT features enable the hybrid model to uncover more complex patterns beyond normal ECG patterns, leading to more accurate prediction on sample with cardiac diseases. Thank you and I hope that you have enjoyed the video.